Repair Clinic encourages you to perform this procedure safely. In this video, we will show one or more of these icons to alert you when to use caution. To replace a ram stop in your trash compactor, you will need to uninstall the appliance from the cabinet. Once the compactor is uninstalled, unplug the power cord. Next, depress the foot pedal. Pull the container drawer assembly forward and lift it off of the track. Next, remove the quarter-inch hex head screws securing the mounting brackets and top panel. Slide the top panel back and lift it off. Now carefully set the compactor on its side. Remove the screws securing the bottom panel. Pull the panel off. Now carefully rotate the large drive gear counterclockwise to disengage the ram from the power screws. Return the compactor to its upright position. Use tape to hold the directional switch lever away from the ram. Now lift the ram out. Pull out the power screw shield covering the ram stop you're replacing. You can now remove the old ram stop. Before you install the new ram stop, first make sure the washer is in place on the power screw. Now slide the new stop onto the screw and apply some grease to both the top and bottom of the stop. Replace the shield. Carefully reposition the ram, making sure the stop bracket is in the front. Set the compactor back on its side. Rotate the large drive gear clockwise to re-engage the ram with the power screws. Replace the bottom panel and reinstall the screws. Return the compactor to its upright position and remove the tape securing the directional switch lever. Replace the top panel. Align the mounting brackets and replace all of the screws. Reposition the container drawer assembly on the track and push it into place. With the repair completed, plug the power cord back in and reinstall the trash compactor in the cabinet.